fans back in stadiums after so long through the pandemic throughout Europe, throughout the world. Waitima to Backman. Waitima calls for it again. Backman into the area, looks to pull the trigger easy for Khaman. Khaki and Bradovic will be looking to put the cat among the pigeons. Backman aiming to do that right now for PSG. Feeds it off to Gayoro. She looks to tease it back through to Quetima. Drops to Diani. Diani tries to get the low shot in. It's blocked by Vysanska and it will trickle out. What the speed has built up to this game for Kharkiv with the luggage delays at the airport missing their training because of that. Quetima tries to get through here. She's picked it up really well. She's got options in the middle. She goes for goal herself. Jordan Quetima on her first start of the season. Crafty finish at the near post from the Olympic gold medalist. And PSG have the breakthrough. Jordan Huitema getting inside of Alexanian. Strong in the run and so composed in the finish. She gave the keeper the eyes. She wouldn't let the defence know whether she was going to pull that back to an opponent. PSG again muscles her way past Kavanska. Finds Backman in a lot of space on the edge of the area. Backman goes for goal again onto the bar and headed in by Fatima, who has a second of the game. Well, Backman with the shot. Your man got a touch on it onto the bar, but in close vicinity was Jordan Fatima and it's turning into a dream Champions League performance by the young Canadian. Nicole, the manager, telling his players to keep concentrating, don't get complacent, but the game now firmly in their control. Great reactions by Quintema. Back home with the shots. Come out onto the bar. But there was only going to be one outcome from the rebound. Couldn't pick out either corner. It was straight down the middle. And over the bar, corner comes in once more. Bit of a scramble, bit of a melee, but Yaman claims it. Kachawi. To Diani, who's switched eyes, takes on Alexanian, gets the beating of her. Has Wittema lurking in there, and she has a hat trick. She made it look so simple, just taps it home. It was a simple finish. But what a dream Champions League game for Jordan Quintema. A first half hat trick for the Tokyo gold medalist. Have a three goal lead approaching the break. Diani has been at the heart of so much that they've created. Strong run by her and the perfect pass to Quintema, who just couldn't miss. Just taps it home. And that smile on Jordan Quetema's face just gets wider and wider. Shevchuk given away though. Gayoro moves into space and offside against Quetema. Lawrence has got space on the right hand side. He's got Quetema in the middle and she goes instead towards, but it was indeed Quetema who got the head on it. But, uh, Rare moment of promise for the visitors, catching PSG on the break. Wuchenko through the middle, but couldn't get any power behind the shots. But there is a yellow card shown. What's that in the direction of Tamer for something that was said? Yarni. Yiddishtet. Does well under pressure, finds Lawrence. Kayoro could get on the end of this now, she will indeed, and your man comes out to block it, but it falls to Khalifi. Her shot is cleared away from the edge of the area, and it falls to Quitema, who skies it. Back to Basanska, who wins her side to throw in. Can't keep bringing it out from the back again. PSG win it back immediately. Gayoro. Gayoro through to Pitema. 
She's onside and she takes a shot on this off the post. Well, that would have been a spectacular fourth. It drops to Khalifi. Lawrence with the shot, blocked by Schmatko and behind for a corner. This was the chance for Itama. What a delicious curling effort that was off the inside of the post. Pirouetted, curled through the middle to Spasajevic, but again, PSG pick it up, and Baltimore forces her way into the area. Shot deflects and deflects again, but wide of Yaman's near post. Boronina tries to push her out wide, keep her out wide, get, but Gioro finds Quitema. Quitema tries to feed it back to Gioro. Will she get there? Yaman's beaten again by Gioro, and it's still alive inside that area. But Stiani picked up the loose ball. Kharkiv just managed to get back in number.